Hello, and welcome to the final video in the discussion of the property sets feature in ChemCAD 7. I'll be demonstrating how, how property sets can be saved for future use outside of the simulation that they were created in. In general, a property set is only available in the simulation where you've created it, but if you've taken the time to customize a set and you feel that you'll want it to use in the future, you can save it to your property set library. To open the property sets library, go to a customize property sets dialog. Here we can reach it from the stream reports menu item. And then click manage set library. On the left side, you'll see all of the simulation sets that are available locally this simulation only. And on the right, you'll see any library sets that you've saved in the past. If you'd like to save a set, you can use the right arrow to bring it into your library, and this will make that property set immediately available to all new simulations that you create. By clicking the left arrow, you can highlight a property set and bring it in to your current simulation if that property set was added to the library after the simulation was created or if you're sharing simulations with another user you may have property sets in your library that you'd like to apply to the simulation while you're using it. To save my changes I'll click OK in both dialogs and then to demonstrate I'll close this simulation and open up a new one to show you that the example property set that I just added to the library is immediately available there. So I'll close this down, open a brand new simulation, and if I just go to report, quick view, and check on my available property sets, you'll see that examples available and so is the library property set that I've also placed in my library. You can also note that the other property sets, such as the stream composition copy that I had available just locally in the last simulation, isn't available here. So if I wanted to bring that over to a new simulation, I'd have to go first go bring it to my library and then open up this simulation. That's all for now. I hope that you've learned a bit about the new flexibility built into our reports by using property sets. Please check out our other videos to learn about the other exciting features in ChemCAD version 7. Thank you.